to the desk. Yeah, baby. I'm Robert Puncher. I'm Dan Laidman. Maximum News. Minimum Pants. Look at that. Here are your news stories for this week. Kansas apologizes for a risque Snoop Dogg performance where stripper poles were brought onto the stadium floor. Said Snoop Dogg in a statement, we were going to do something a little bit cleaner, but Martha got in shape for this, so... The website named the rise and fall of democracy.com is now up for sale. Said one man, oh, that's so much better than RudyGiuliani.com. Simone Biles was just named the most decorated female gymnast in history. Meanwhile, Johnny Depp was named the most decorated. Period. A massive 98-pound Burmese python was captured in Florida. Not to be outdone, a 600-pound human centipede was found in Disneyland. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. It was a 600-pound regular single person. Even though we delivered that joke as a human. Ha! The desk. The desk. Bringing us together. Cory Booker did a Hebrew prayer on Yom Kippur, and what better way to celebrate the Day of Atonement than by doing something you will definitely regret later. The STDs, gonorrhea, chlamydia, and syphilis have risen to an all-time high in the U.S., said the man who got all three. Yes, I was Dan Laidman's college roommate. AP News wrote that a goat ran through a screen door and immediately passed out in a bathroom, becoming the newest sorority member. A lawsuit says that feds are using immigration marriage interviews as a trap, as opposed to the other trap often used in marriage, marriage. Hallie Bieber just showed her gorgeous new wedding dress photos, and Justin Bieber just showed off his, I don't want to say, new duck costume? A study shows that dog owners are 24% less likely to die for any reason, which I honestly don't believe, Dan. Uh... Oh. For the desk, I've been Robert Puncher. I've been Dan Laitman. Have a great week. The desk? The desk.